Hello and welcome to my Tube Atlas review. This is going to be for a product that comes out on May 23rd. I wanted to get this review as fast to you as possible because one, this is a great software if you're looking to get an advantage when it comes to YouTube overall. And plus, depending on when you're watching this, you can actually get a very nice discount and even if you miss that discount, you're still going to be getting great value for the price that's given. So what is this all about? As it says right here, Breakthrough Software uncovers top searches, YouTube shorts, hashtags, videos, channels, and trends from YouTube with 12 plus built-in tools. That is not a typo. Something I like initially off the bat, which I'm going to be showing you in the demo, is the fact that it just comes with so many tools for you to utilize when it comes to actually using this. If I go to the next page right here, you can see there's the keyword generator, trends generator, and video analyzer, browser extractor, uh, channel analyzer, video text converter, comment analyzer, content spinner, video title generator. We have video downloader, tag analyzer, and of course, video title analyzer. That's a lot to like, especially if you're looking to really shortcut a lot of the process in terms of research and anything else. Allow me to show you how it works. So Tube Atlas is going to be something that is downloadable. It's not going to be in the cloud. It's always nice when you can get something in the cloud, but the fact that you have to download it, you know, not a big deal at all. Let's look at the keyword research aspect. For example, I'm going to type in ClickFunnels. This is a very popular software. So anytime you're looking for a seed keyword, it's going to be like the main aspect in your niche or maybe a product. So it could be just like weight loss. It could be dog training. It could be keto. It could be uh, best recipes or whatever it's going to be. And we can change the search range where it's going to be anything that's after the seed keyword. For example, like ClickFunnels affiliate or affiliate landing page ClickFunnels. That's going to be either before or after. And then we can do after seed keyword, which takes much longer depending on how you wouldn't want to do it. But just to start, I'm going to click on this and click generate. And the beautiful thing about this is that normally this takes a lot longer to do. Like I didn't skip anything there. That probably took a few seconds. These are some of the best keywords when it relates to ClickFunnels. In other words, when someone goes into YouTube, a lot of the autocompletes are going to be these. And you can even change it by rank depending on where it is in relation. Like these are all the ones, but they're going to start with different things. So as you can see, a lot of these are going to be some of the best keywords. And this is just for ClickFunnels. In the whole entire world of affiliate marketing and internet marketing, like ClickFunnels is like 1% compared to not even 1%. It's like 0.0001%. So you can imagine how much more traffic you can get if you're searching for a really broad keyword like weight loss or anything else that I had mentioned previously. When you're getting going from there, it even takes it a step further. We can utilize these keywords and throw them into trends. So for example, let's say I like this one. Oops. I like the 30 day free trial. I like pricing. I like this one as well. And let's go with the review. And the cool thing what I can do is click on the send selected to trends tool button. And if you notice, it goes right here and we have our next section, which is going to be trends. Keep in mind, like I talked about, there are a ton of features on this. I'm just going to show you some of my favorites. All in all, in keywords, in case you were curious, like this will save your research to just such a minimal amount of time. Just for that right there is going to be worth it because when it comes to YouTube, keyword research is essential. In fact, I do all my keyword research usually by just typing in the seed keyword, seeing what comes up. And this just generates it for you right there. Uh, and just because of that, like a big thumbs up, even if it just had that for the feature, it would be a great software, but it has much more. Trends is going to be cool because this is similar to Google Trends, but it's going to give you a few more data points that actually Google Trends doesn't have, like the total average and trend slope. So now that I put a few over there, we can actually start this up and click on go. And as you'll see, there's going to be specific uh, sections when it comes to country, time period, category. Those aren't as big of a deal, but we have word count, character count, total average, and trend slope. So as you can see, this is actually a good reason why not much is given there because I remember ClickFunnels had a 30 free day trial for like 30 days and then it disappeared. So there's no surprise to see why there's not a lot going on there. Aside from that, you can click on these if you want. You can actually go to Google too as well, analyze it, see how it's doing. You can view it on Google Trends. One thing I do want to mention is the fact that you can't go too crazy crazy when it comes to just this one feature. There is the ability like where if you want to do hundreds and even thousands of these, which you might not even need to utilize, there is the option to use proxies, whether it's going to be free or paid. Keep in mind though, he does have video tutorials for all of these. So he walks you through all the steps. So it's very easy to do. So that's up to you if you want to utilize that. Everything else is going to be free to go. Okay, there's something else I really want to show you. It's going to be the channels. I think this is one of the best features. And keep in mind, there's so many more aside from what I'm showing you here. What I want to do is to say affiliate marketing. And we're going to look for channels that are related to this and have something on the first page of YouTube. You can obviously change that, but I'm going to click on search and let's let it load. 
Okay, I want to say that took about 20 seconds or so, but not too bad when you consider the fact we have 116 channels. Now, the really cool thing is the data that this gives you. If I scroll down here, you can see there's going to be obviously the channel which we had, but we have total videos, total views, subscribers, their estimated total earnings, their average earnings per video, but we can go much deeper into that. We can actually sort these by who has the most videos. And if we do that, we can analyze the channels even further, which is going to be so much better than just going to a specific channel. Channel, seeing like the most views they have for their top videos and so on and so forth. So if I scroll down, I'm going to go to one that doesn't have a ton of them. Let's see total videos, let's say in the hundreds. So they're probably not too big. Okay, so I came up with this one. What I want to do is just check that off. I can right click here, channel tools, let this load and click on analyze videos for selected channel. Okay, so here we are with the videos. What we can do is click on the start auto scroll. What it's gonna do is drag us all the way to the bottom so we can see all the videos that are being shown. And as you see, we go all the way to the beginning where they started six years ago. What I wanna do now is extract video links. So let's click on extract video links. Keep in mind, there are gonna be tutorials for all of this. Here are all the links to the videos that they have. Now we click on add links and add links to video tools. So here are all the videos that we have. Now that we've extracted all of the videos from that specific channel, we can get all the specific data for them so we can see what has the most views, which normally you can do, but you can compare that to what's been around the longest, what gets the most amount of views on average per day, which one makes the most amount of money. Obviously, it's not going to be exact, but when it's close enough, that's some great data that you can utilize to start creating your own videos based upon what's working for someone else. Let's click on Get Data. Okay, and so once again, that took about maybe 20 to 30 seconds, but now we have every single video in that person's channel. What we can do is scroll through, look, look at all this data. We can go by views if we want. So we see which obviously have done the best. We have one that's 100,000, 85,000, 47,000, and so on and so forth. We have one that has the most amount of likes we can sort by. Obviously, the more likes, the more people are watching it, the more they're liking it. You can do the same with comments. Okay, sometimes look at this one. This has 75 comments and only 7,000 views, okay? Despite the fact that it's not getting a ton of views, that's a lot of engagement. So that's something to keep in mind. Also length and seconds. And if we scroll down even more, some of my favorites, we have published age and then of course, average views per day. I really like this one. So depending on how long it's been around, like this one's been around for a long time, but if you look at this, some of these have been only like 682. I mean, it sounds like it's, you know, a long time, but it's really not all that bad. So if we highlight this one, we can see which video that is. Obviously, if we want to double click on that, open it up, we can check it out, see what they're ranking for, the best new affiliate program, and so on and so forth. And of course, we also have the really good stat that I like, this is the estimated video earnings. Okay, once again, this is a great one. You can look for great videos here that maybe don't have a ton of views. So if we look at here, obviously, these are going to be the tops. And of course, this is obviously just kind of a uh, estimate. It's not going to be 100% perfect. But, but what's good about this, it obviously gives you some of the most popular videos, one with the most engagement, the most comments, average views per days, and of course, estimated video earnings. I think these two are some of the biggest, but you can't really get a lot of data like this. In fact, you can't get most of this just by looking at a channel. You can sort by most popular, newest, or oldest. And we have all this data like that. It makes it so much easier for you to do your research, see what's working, and just specifically combining these three tools together, these features in this tool, is going to make for a great time when it comes to doing your YouTube research. As I talked about, there's going to be 12 total tools that you can utilize with this. Like, I don't want to make my review too long. Just from those three that I, I specifically like the most, I think you're going to get a lot out of this, especially for the fact that they have even nine more tools that you can utilize as they're shown right here. Let's talk about the price. When this does launch, it's going to be $37. And then going up from there, it's going to reach to $67. Whether you get it at $37 or $67, either way is going to be a great deal, especially for the fact that there's not too many software tools around like this, especially when it comes to doing keyword research, which in my opinion is one of the biggest things in terms of improving with YouTube, see what's working. And of course, creating the right videos so you can generate leads, more traffic, more sales, whatever it's going to be. So keep in mind that this does go live May 23rd. So whether you're before or after, make sure you check out the link down below. They might have a special deal before it starts and make sure the faster you get there after the launch date, the faster you can get a better discount on this. And overall, this is definitely two thumbs up. I love specifically just those three features that I showed you. That's why I wanted to highlight them. I'm gonna start using this even more when it comes to my YouTube keyword research because I understand the effectiveness of 
this, the data that it gives you. And when you utilize this properly, you can certainly get an extra upper hand in terms of the advantage of using YouTube. So thank you so much for watching the Tube Atlas review. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I can always do more demos or different aspects of this if needed. I didn't want to make it too long. I wanted to make sure that you're aware of this and it's a great tool if you want to get your research on the fast track and overall just be able to spy on competitors, see what's working well, and of course, grow your YouTube overall. Thank you so much for watching. The link is down below and enjoy.